Good evening, everyone. This is Lyra, as always. Happy Friday. I'm happy it's Friday. God damn. Uh, it was a difficult day today. Uh, things got really weird at the end. So, uh, I know that uh, the other day I said that I was going to play Silent Hill 1 before Silent Hill 3. Because Silent Hill 3 is a continuation of the story of Silent Hill 1. But uh, PS1 emulation is never worth it and never good and horrible and terrible. And I count my blessings at his PS2 emulation. So, tonight we're playing Silent Hill 3. Also, hello Nick, hello Beth, and hello Marcia. Okay, uh, let's resume this real quick. Switch to game feed. Okay, come on. T t turn back on, please. I had this working beforehand. I just hope that this unpauses well enough. I'm sure Silent Hill 3 is an appropriate antidote to weirdness. It's a great game, okay? Here we go. We're good. I have a widescreen mod in, uh, I have a widescreen uh, hack in it and everything, so it's going to look choice. Choice gore. Choice disturbing scenery. Choice valve turning. But valve? 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 Also, this game has copious amounts of Mary Elizabeth McLinn in it, the singer of this song. Also, one of my favorite singers ever. Really, even compared to Silent Hill 2, this game is a treat. Also, trust me when I say that uh, it only looks so blurry right now because it's an FMV and I can't really do anything about that. But once we actually start rendering the game, it's going to look nice. It's going to look good. A little loud? I turned it down a little bit. Let me know if it's okay. Also, that was the knife. That's the worst weapon in the game. So, uh, given that this game is a continuation of the story of Silent Hill 1, let's give a brief high-level recap. Silent Hill 1, basically, you look for your daughter who was lost in Silent Hill. Turns out your daughter was half of a witch girl named Alessa. Uh, Alessa being Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, don't do this. I'm trying to explain, okay? Alessa was a witch girl who was pretty much tortured by a cult in Silent Hill. And the reason why Silent Hill is all fucked up is because of her latent powers making everything fucked up. So, uh, yeah, at the end of Silent Hill 1 in the canon ending, uh, Harry Mason, the protagonist of that game, walks away with a baby version of Alessa after she died and made herself into a baby. Because uh, witch girls do that. That's all you need to know. Just know that Alessa has a crazy psychosexual trauma powers. <laughs> also, this is an amazing song. This song is named Breather. Oh, by the way, uh, fun fact. So uh, there are a few extra cutscenes in this game that appear as Easter eggs. If you have a, um, if you have a Silent Hill 2 completed save on the memory card, and as it so happens, I do have a Silent Hill 2 me uh, save on the memory card. You guys know that because I uh, streamed that game. So we're gonna see the extra shit. I did stream that game good. I streamed that game fast. I streamed that game in two streams. God damn. Uh, I honestly don't know if uh, this one will be uh, more or less streams. Last time I played this game, I played it in one day. I kind of just wanted to play some Silent Hill. Okay. There we go. See? Uh, extra new game is there because, like I said, I played this game a few months ago and I'll re I still have the save from it. But we're getting a new game. Normal action level, normal riddle level. Because, um, I'm not enough of a try hard to go hard mode. Please forgive me. <laughs> there were some stairs, they were there, also fog. Yep, that's Silent Hill, that's all you needed to know. Your explanation was so much better than mine. Aw, 
also uh, have some pleasant imagery. Uh, namely, this uh, bondage vibration horse. It's everyone's favorite, right? There he is, see? Everyone say hello to bondage vibration horse. A uh, hard riddle level just makes the riddles hard. Like, um, every riddle, they have a version for easy mode, a version for normal mode, and a version for hard mode. Normal, um, easy mode, they pretty much just tell you what to do when you do it. Normal mode, they give you a puzzle and all the information that you need to solve it is in-game, but you have to think about the information they give you. And hard mode actually requires, um, information from outside the game. For example, um, there's a puzzle in this game that uh, involves lining up some books, some Shakespeare, sh some Shakespeare books to decode uh, a keypad lock. Uh, and in the hard mode uh, version, you actually have to decipher a poem that describes uh, some of Shakespeare works, Shakespeare's works, and you need to put those books in order based on that poem. Normal mode doesn't do that, so we're doing normal mode because I don't remember my Shakespeare. Also, everyone say hello to Robbie the Rabbit. Rabbit doll. No, it's a costume. Is there someone in there? It looks like there is, but I don't feel like making sure. I uh, don't feel like making sure either, because he kind of looks a little fucked up. Or is that just strawberry jam? Who knows? Uh, this, uh, this guy's neck has seen better days. Also, there's a hole here. You can fall in this hole. When I was testing out this game two hours ago, I fell in this hole. Don't fall in the hole. And what's this? Something strange in a KG box thing? A person? Not quite. I don't really want to stare at it for very long, whatever it is. By the way, Heather is great. I like Heather. She's sassy. You might see right now that we're holding a knife. Well, the knife is a shitty weapon. So... What we're going to do is we're going to say no to knives and we're going to say yes to submachine guns. It is upscaled. Uh, 1080p, I want to say. Uh, widescreen hack. I widescreen hacked it. Ah, I missed. Let's see. Uh, dream sequence. Where does dream sequence lead us to? I don't remember. Here. Her outfit is cute. Heather is just cute. Rabbit stuffed animal. Oh yes, in the dream sequence, there's nothing here. We come back to this amusement park later and there are things here. But right now it's nothing. Luck's broken. It's okay, we have a submachine gun. We don't need anything else. It's not like we need more bullets for it or anything. Hey, hey, hey. No! Am I shooting you? I don't actually know. Oh, we were shooting it. Get kicked. Get kicked. It takes multiple kicks to kill closers, uh, and they're e they're still in the way even after you kill them. Shut tight. Oh, camera switch. That means something's important. Oh god, there's more closers. I hate closers. I fucking hate closers. Whoa, hey, hey, hey! Let's not embar embarrass myself twice in one day. Okay, dogs. Uh, whoa. whoa. Uh, yeah, if you run too hard at those edges, you. Oh, wait, hey! Come on, let me get to the actual ending of the stream sequence. Don't just kill me right away. Uh, I promise it'll be brighter. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, it's uh, dark because I turned the light off. That's why. Whoops, sorry about that. Okay, we good. It's locked. I'm sure that's fine, right? Uh, can I... Can, highway... Da danger zone? Can I take a highway here? Anyway, this is an okay place to be. Let's go. Oh, that was the sounds of uh, families having fun in this family-friendly location. 
How's the volume, by the way? Let me know. We're good. We're good. We are just fine. This is a cutscene of just fine. Marcia, you don't need to know what's happening. Because this is happening. Hello. Whoops. Oh, but guess what? G -g guess? There we go. Oh, right. Yes, it was all just a dream. See, it doesn't have to make me sense. There doesn't have to be any backstory. It was all just a dream. We won't be going back there at any point. No, siree. Don't you have dreams of... Uh, just being in a carnival of blood and rust and getting run over by a roller coaster. It's fine, right? It means nothing's wrong. That is the product of a healthy and active imagination. Also, who the hell falls asleep at a fast food? Get it together, Heather. She is hella cute. She's also hella sassy. I love Heather. Heather is best girl. Also, um, widescreen mod, so expect to see people just uh, stopping slightly in frame in cutscenes. That's just uh, comes with the territory. <laughs> Dad, it's me. Yeah. Sorry I didn't call sooner. It's okay, Heather. You're forgiven. Yeah, I guess I was. Anyway, I'm coming home now. Oh, I didn't get that thing you asked me to. You'll get him next time. Okay. <laughs> okay, I will. I love you too, Dad. But what's this? Could this be Stranger Danger? No, no, it's not Stranger Danger. Heather, I need to speak with you. My name is Douglas Clark. Hey, Zach. So this guy's Douglas. Um, really? so I had a choice to make before I started this game. Once you have a clear game save on your memory card, when you start a new game, you can actually input a cheat code uh, that causes him to only be in his underwear in every cutscene he's in. So if I inputted that ch uh, that cheat code, he would be in his underwear right now. And I had a decision to make. I had to decide whether I wanted to enable that or not. Clearly, I chose no. Also, Heather doesn't want what you're selling. Are you still following me? I turned the, I the volume scream? up just a little bit. Sorry. I'll wait here. Of course I'm denying you old man boxers. It's more like I'm denying myself old man boxers. It's more just like I really love the story of this game and I kind of want to take it a little seriously. Just just a wee bit. Just a scotch. Also, a uh, satanic graffiti in the bathroom allows us to save. Has to check the memory card first, of course. Okay, yep, that was our save data. For, that was my save data from when I finished this game. So we're just gonna make a new one. Also, this game has a great soundtrack. Anyone home? No, oh, keep doing it. Heather, Heather, let's be rude. We're not being rude. Okay, out through the window. Because Heather is a fucking rebel. She does not want to talk to old men. She does not have time through this. Out through the goddamn window. Also, there's nothing over there, so we are forced to walk through here. Okay, well, we can still pretend that everything's fine, but this is a Silent Hill game, so it's time to check every door. 
uh, with um, superior camera controls, of course. Lock's broken. I expect to see lots of broken locks. Because the art of locksmithing is a forbidden and secret and lost art. In Silent Hill. Through here. Clearly we're being fo Oh god, someone needs- Do they not hire janitors here? Or, um, soundproofing? God, what's that sound in the distance? I do not like what it sounds like. I'm not playing coy, of course. It's not like I've played this game three times before. All right, get a room, you two. Is this the room that they got? Okay, this is the gun room. This is the room where you procure, procure gun. Because, um, this is America. Specifically Portland. This is Portland. And in Portland, we eat people. Oh, whoa. Hello, texture error. <laughs> oh, God. In Portland, our textures break. And then Heather quickly exercises her Second Amendment rights. With an unlicensed gun that she picked up off the floor. And that just uh, happened to have the correct amount of bullets. Also monster ass. That thing's a closer. It's bad. What the hell is this thing? That's something we're going to try never to kill because it eats bullets. It's definitely not human. I've never heard of such an animal. And no way is it a costume. Sounds crazy when you say it, but monster is the only word for it. But I don't think I'm crazy. Hmm. Well, I'd rather pick up, um, bullets than corpse. I can tell from here that it's dead. Should I call the police? Not like they'd believe me if I said someone's been killed by a monster. Let's take a good look at that corpse. No? Let's not take a good look at that corpse? Okay, it's just a corpse. This isn't like uh, Silent Hill 2 where all the corpses are James. Uh, the corpses are just corpses. They're not like symbolic of inner tur turmoil and guilt. They're just symbolic of death. Anyway, that's just a path back to that place, which is useless because there's nothing there. That's a map, which is very useful. Jesus Christ. Also, for any new people that are watching right now, hi, my name's Lyra. I stream games that I like. Sometimes it's anime girls. Sometimes it's scary. Sometimes it's scary anime girls. I don't know. Is Heather an anime girl? The jury's still out. All right, here we go, kids. Now we are playing Silent Hill proper. Tutorial over. Oh, oh reload. No, 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 ow. Well, I'm good at this game. Let's just find a place to go and not deal with this fucker. Not deal with this fucker. Oh, door. Ha, you missed. Get some glasses on that uh, weird Walking dick? Oh, Jesus. Uh, actually, this is just... Yeah, it's gonna... gonna, gonna... Oh, no! Yeah! Ow! No, no, no! No! That wasn't worth it. Beef jerky isn't even a healing item. It just attracts dogs. Like, so you can, like, get around them, you know? Hey, Jem. Thanks for dropping by. Uh, okay. Right, these things do no, no damage. This is the supply room. Two health drinks, which is good, and handgun bullets. And mysterious item we cannot reach. 
My arms are a little longer. I might be able to reach it. Yes, the item that we'll pick up to get those is um, our arm extensions. Let me... Thank you. Also, so that Zach doesn't yell at me, we're using two saves for this one. You better be happy. Okay. Oh. oh. Nope. See it. Oh, no. Uh, wow, that's awkward. You know when you say, like, bye to someone, but you're actually going the same direction? That's what that was. Okay, we got stairway, and we have two extra doors in that direction. Good to know. Now, which way would those be? To the right. Okay, so we're definitely going out this way. Okay, here we go. Uh, Sunshine Princess is not open for business. Uh, this closer is open for business. Jesus Christ. Natalie, shoo us. I already know there's nothing in there. Okay, uh, bookstore. Yep, bookstore is closed. Uh, Key of Beauty. Whoa, hello. Whoa, hey, thanks for the 10 bits, Zach. I appreciate it. Are you bribing me to use three save, save files? Is that what's happening right now? Because I'm easily bribed, and I will do that, if that's what you want. Crispy toasted bread, right to your very door. Oh, and also, thanks for the host, Zach. I'm sorry that I can't deliver crispy toasted bread right to your door. There it is. Tongs. Should be in every horror, uh, horror game's uh, protagonist toolbox. So, I hope I don't have to explain what the tongs are for. I mean, they're no arm lengtheners, but, you know. Okay, where was that? Uh, that was on the last door on the right. No, dodge, dodge! Get juked. Okay, we are well underway. Oh, wait, I need to use it from the menu, don't I? Whoops. Okay, I get it. Use tongs. It's a big pair of tweezer-like tongs for grabbing bread and keys. Key grabbed. And now we throw those tongs away because fuck tongs. Ah, yes, key taken with tongs. It's a really specific name. Thank goodness that key was there, or else I would have been named that for no reason, huh? All right, three save files, just for Zach's sensibilities. So, what, what could we ever do with key taken with tongs? There's a tag on the key that says my bestsellers, and that was locked, so we're going back. Oh my god, uh, oh, he brought friends. Uh. He brought friends that can't aim. Suckers. Get good. Okay, my best sellers is this way. And there's also a closer this way. Uh, uh. But they're also slow as hell, so we're fine. Open. Open. Thank you. Thankfully, that gigantic thing with arms that can break glass does not break glass and follow us. So, what have we here? We have handgun bullets, and less importantly... Come on, read it. Fair is foul, and foul is fair. Put these books out of order. And we have a keypad here. I'm not going to show you that, because that's obviously what it is. So, what books are we putting out of order, you say? Well, it's just just gigantic mess here. Pick it up. And here's a shelf. So, let's just uh, use some books, why don't we? Uh, right. You just use one of them, that's right. You don't combine them all. That would be silly. Okay. 
Um, let's see. Well, it's not there. Let's see if we find a right edge here. It's not. Okay, that one's the left edge. You'll see what I'm going for here. Okay, here we go. Uh huh. We want the right edge of a six. Uh, could that be it? Maybe. That kind of looks a little suspect. No, not like that. Okay, that one goes right here. Then this one goes here. And this one goes here. Six, nine, seven, four. Puzzle solved. And like I said, if I uh, if I chose um, hard mode difficulty, then that would have required knowledge of Shakespeare. Because there would have been a poem there. It would have been horrible. 6974. Six, nine, seven, four. Easy. It's the first puzzle. Ah, oh, great. The nuns are here. Um, hey, wait. What's going on? Where is everybody? Those weird monsters? They're God's punishment because your skirt's too short. That was my second guess. What are you talking about? Don't you know? Your power is needed. How should I know? A reasonable answer. Also, she Don't doesn't wear shoes. Remember me and your true self as well. Also, that which you must become. Listen, lady, I didn't turn on normal puzzle mode so that I'd have to listen to your riddles. Bloodstained hands. Claudio, right? Did you do all this? It was the hand of God. <laughs> oh, the cop out answer. And now the cop out headache. Her talking is a tad quiet. Good to know. That might have just be game audio balance issues here. I'm going to turn the gain reducer up just a little bit. Or down, rather. We'll see if that works better. I don't get it. Oh, you'll get it. Want me to remember. Okay. So. Broken. Broken. I actually can't remember if there are any usable doors in this hallway. I think this is just a uh, cutscene hallway o'clock. Oh, it's Hungarian throat chanting o'clock. Listen to that shit. Hey, Tira Lira, you know what these games should really be called? Mercia, it's too early for this. Can I, can I go? Yes, okay, great. Real fake doors the game. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's not like there's anything behind those doors after all. Wow, that's handy. Thanks for the shit radio. They should be hiring some janitors here. Look at this place, it's a mess. But all they got is people throwing down radios down the elevator shaft. And uh, people fucking in the elevator shaft. Really loving the interior decor here. Not even a kid could believe in this. Well, I hope you guys uh, recognize this decor. Welcome back to the other world. 
This game does not let up. We are already in the other world. Half an hour into the stream and we are here. Okay, and it already begins. Yep! Dogs. Dogs. I don't like dogs. Thankfully, the game lets up, lets, lets up on the dogs a little bit in later areas. This is our room of respite. And pool right at the beginning of the game, which is kind of interesting. Okay. Thankfully, save, uh, save uh, circles can be anywhere. We're going to keep cycling saves here. So, uh, I mean, obviously, since we're in the other world, but now we have to be kind of really careful because we can get hit all over the place in here. Okay, this way first. Is anything here going anywhere? No, it's not. Let's run towards the sound of obvious flesh being mangled. Okay, let's just be nice and quiet here. And run! No! Okay, we're good. That is, uh, strangely enough, a door. All right, I can't do anything here yet. Because there's a ladder up there. And we can't do anything about it. It's too high. Heather's a shorty. We'll be back, though. Uh, do I need to reload? Is there a reload button? I don't actually know if there's a reload button. Am I even... Do I even need to reload? Oh, okay, I don't need to reload. Whatever. Okay, back out we go. All right, we don't have the light yet. I was wondering why it was so dark. Oh god, closer. Oh, this is where it came from. Oh. Pro dodging. God, this place sucks. This way. No, not this way. Now these guys sound like broken glass. That's kind of unnerving. Okay, we're good. Now what have we in here? We have... First aid, bullet, bullet. I don't think there's actually anything of any use in here, come to think of it. Warning, when leaving the room, be sure to turn out the lights. It will be obvious if they are not switched off. Clever. That's also the game's way of telling you that uh, enemies see you better if you have the light on. For now, I can kind of see, so we're just gonna keep going about. Oh, crap. Crap. Ugh. Okay, we're good. Good thing we went in here, too, because this item's required. Bleach. The anime. Oh. There's... Hey, buddy. Uh, are you inviting us in? Oh. Uh, uh, hmm. Someone had a bad time in here. Someone had a very bad time in here. Yep, that's it for this room. Back out we go. We have bleach. <laughs> Okay. Let's keep on going. We can slip right under here. Okay. We're done going through that door. Oh, shit. Um, is there actually... Shit! Let me through! This is that clothes shop uh, that um, we got the gun from. Except the uh, other world version. Oh, right, yeah. 
Yeah, the game requires you get the flashlight before you can actually progress in this area. Wow. Oh, wait. We want this. Because uh, I am clumsy. I take damage. And so, what will we wear? A Kevlar vest. Makes us a little slower, but that's fine. I don't mind. It's not really that noticeable. Oh, wait. Was there something there? I saw you looking at something. Oh, you're just looking at the door. Right, I forgot. Uh, Heather looks at doors that she can go through. Oh! Uh, that scared me a little bit. <laughs> yeah, it was just this thing. We're fine. Okay, so now we need just need to take that path backwards. Because that hanger can be used for that ladder. Oh shit. This is a bad place for a closer. Okay, let's see. Where was it? Okay, I just need to turn that corner there. Good to know. Turn around at the end of the hallway. Excuse me, pardon me. Still fast enough to dodge their attacks, and that's good enough for me. Okay, here we go. Now all we need is just go into our inventory, and yeah! Ah, this girl has some ingenuity, and also some nerves of steel. She's surprisingly calm for being in a hellhole full of blood and rust and monsters. Well, I guess a game in which uh, someone just has a panic attack and gets killed while they're panicking wouldn't be a really good game, would it? This isn't a hospital. Oh, Heather. What, have you never played a Silent Hill game before? Come on. Silent Hill has a thing for hospital stuff. Hey there. Oh wait, no, I'm not into that. If you've played Silent Hill 1 before, you'll uh, recognize what that little flash of an image there was for there. And also, this is a satan sat Satanic Circle TV. It's my favorite channel. Okay. I kind of think it's useless to go in here, though, if I remember correctly. For now. What's this? Walnut. Okay, walnuts is good. A walnut will open the path for us. Oh, Jesus. Yep. Yep. Okay. God, if those things attacked any faster, they would be a lot more deadly. Oh, great. I just boxed myself in. Now we're fine. Several locked doors. Oh, great. I did just box myself in. Um, There's a door there at the end of the hallway, but other than that, I can go back to Nut Room. Bring me back to Nut Room. Remind me again the topography here. Okay, just straight ahead. And then there's an elevator there, but I'm pretty sure that's useless. At least we got uh, an idea of what the doors are like over there. Oh, jeez. Uh. Uh, no, 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 no. Don't look at your map right now. Step. Uh, wait, actually. 
actually, ac actually, I changed my mind. Uh, I can't change my mind. Jesus. You're really busting my balls here. Come on. Um, supplies. Health drink. This is embarrassing. Come on. Okay. Step. Uh, stop that. I don't like that motion. Okay, we're good. Move. Move. Thank you. Okay. And gun health. I don't know what's worse. The sounds when there's monsters near or the absolute silence when they're not near. Um. Okay. I think we're done here. At least I'll make this place a lot less of a pain in the ass to move around in. Wait, where am I now? Oh, right, but there's... Okay. Okay, turn back around. We're going upstairs. There's gotta be more things up there. Like static TVs. My favorite. <sighs> Let's see... This is good. By the way, I hope everyone noticed my new um, profile picture on Twitch and on Twitter and on my Discord server. That was a uh, gorgeous art drawn by my lovely girlfriend, Beth, of my Final Fantasy XIV character. Also, this is Barbecued Dog. What do you do when you find a barbecued dog? Do you call the police? No, you reach inside of it. You go elbow deep into the uh, barbecued dog. Uh, Alright, more healing supplies. I would like more bullets, though. If that's okay. Okay, we're good here. So, let's see if barbecued dog can tell us anything about where it goes to. Well, that's house key. Uh, nope. Well, there's only one locked door anyway, so let's go use it. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Oh, and do not hang up game. I don't like that. Oh, yep, that's a puzzle door. I already know what goes in it, so we're not going to read it. Because we are under assault. I think there's one more puzzle item up here that we want. Is this it? Knock, knock, enter, enter. No. Oh, okay. There's just literally nothing in here, is there? Fine. Uh, is that it for this floor? It appears that it is. Okay. Back we go. To the stairs. No, you pain in the ass. Stop. No, don't step on me. Only I can step on you. Oh, wait. I'm in uh, danger. Yep. Yep. I get it. Okay. Now I can go back through here and right to the locked door. See, good thing I killed those things. Pay no mind to the distant sounds that are meant to creep you out. Okay, end of the hallway to the right. Oh, okay. Turn me around, why don't you? Cooked key. Is 
Is this the site of the cooking? Ooh, health drinks. Give me. Hell yeah, steel pipe. That's our first melee weapon that's actually worth a damn. I'm gonna put that on. Menu, yep. I wonder if there's cooked dog on the menu. Would that be a coincidence? Okay, through we go. What have we here? Oh, wait, no, stop it. We've got a big place here. So let's just start exploring. Yeah, these places don't even count as doors, it seems. Oh, hello. Keep it down over there. I'm trying to... Huh? Was that a sound? I think I heard a sound. Hello there. Detergent. And nothing? Is that nothing? It's kind of standing out. Are you sure it's nothing? Just detergent? Okay, just detergent. At least we can do our laundry now. And after spending literally a nanosecond in this place, I would not blame Heather if she wants to do that right now. Okay. We've got nothing here. Okay. Well, detergent is required as well, so... Good thing we came here. And this opens the play path to a new place. Oh, and speak of the devil. Yep, hello. So. We're gonna... Turn that off. We're gonna go in here. So there's a bunch of bugs in here, see? And, uh, yeah, we can't pass them. Insecticide. How does one make insecticide, you say? Well, uh, by combining dangerous chemicals, of course. Don't do this at home. I mean it. This will kill you. Heather can only do it because she's Heather. Nobody else can. Do not do this at home. And now we're just going to vent the place. Also, this place is nothing. And voila, dead bugs. How was your little um, unethical science lesson of the day? Okay, where to now? Someone's having a bad time. Multiple people are having bad times. Oh wait, those are just dogs, aren't they? God, I love the lighting in this game. Jerky. Yeah, this is just a give you things room. I'm a fan of those rooms. Uh, which way was I going? I want to go to my right. This way. Okay. Anything creepy over here? Okay. Oh dear. Oh dear. Yep, that's just a room you may possibly get fucked in. Oh, Jesus. And now we're out here. Okay, fine. Let's turn back around and check all the other doors. And not get hit by a closer. Okay. Oh, that was an experience. Which way am I going here? I'm going straight. So far, nothing. I'd like to risk my life for something if I'm here. And 
and uh, this is just a hole. I will remind you, you can fall into holes. Okay, fine, fine. Back to the closer room. Back, back, back. Oh, sorry, having a quick seizure. Okay, we're good. Oh, jeez. No, 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 no. Feckin' closers. Okay, we're good. Off we go. Whoa, hey, 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 hey. No need to demonstrate. Just take my word for it. Also, we got literal windmills of death here. God, I hate this place. This place is safe, though. That's because it has a save point. No monsters and save points. We're making good time. Okay, here we go. So, we have a vice here. And one might ask themselves, what does one do with a vice? Well, you put a walnut in it. No wonder, uh, you know, no matter that it's all bloodied and rusted and stuff, you put the walnut in it. And we get a moonstone, because that's what's in walnuts. Makes sense, right? Welcome to Silent Hill. So with that, we can actually go back downstairs. I believe that's it to this area besides that. Oh dear. Um... Let's just keep going this way. Can I have a shortcut, please? Oh, hey! Um, uh, uh, loud. Okay, what am I doing here? What indeed am I doing here? I should check that door, actually. Hey. Where is that door? Oh, right. That door doesn't exist. There's a wall here. Yeah, fine. Okay, if I remember correctly, and I probably don't. Sorry, I just... Uh, it's not about your dumb jokes. I'm just focusing on the game. Um... Okay... Now there's some jerks here where, where we picked up... Okay, fine. Melee combat! Ow! Door! Oh, great. I'm at low health again. Not doing good. No, up, 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 up. Okay, just back through this way. Okay, we're good. Don't give me a hard time when I'm trying just to finish this area. The first area, in fact. Just gonna give a quick save here because there are things about to happen. Here we go. So, remember that door that I said that I already knew what we're doing with? There was a little hole in it and we have a moonstone. And there was a moon on it. I'm in a hole next to the moon. That's moonstone shaped. Did, do I really need to go any further of this? Okay. Um, please hold. Thank you. What does it say? Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, just gonna use this, okay. Let me in. Okay. We're done here. This is now just enter ladder. Uh, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Excellent, we're good. What a thrill. 
I'm not singing the rest of this song. That's why. We're just gonna cut, cut, fade, fade the black hair. Oh boy. Climbing down ladders to boss arenas is a common theme in this game. I don't think it's even symbolism of anything or anything. They just really like climbing down ladders to boss arenas. There is occasionally humming in game. It's just creepy sounds from the, 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 the distance. Also exploding ladders. Casual exploding ladders. What could this first boss be? Why, it's none other than, whoa, hello there. That's a little too big for me, geez. I don't think I can fit that. Why did I just say that? <laughs> Okay, uh, <laughs> um, uh, gun, gun. We are not meleeing this thing. I hope I don't have to, uh, understand. I don't, I hope I don't have to explain why I'm not me meleeing this thing. Yeah, this thing's really easy. You just don't stand in front of it. That's the strategy. Also, uh, here comes the chanting for the dick worm. Yeah, you just want to shoot it from an angle. Please, stop that. Trust me when I say we're doing damage, even though you can't see it. Come on, buddy. We don't have all day. Oh, should have reloaded in the menu. Nope. Oh. Oh, hey, time to practice what I preach. Uh, 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 this is some Shin Megami Tensei nonsense. Yep, yeah, pretty much. Come on, next one, next one. Oh, there it is. Uh, excuse me while I not stand in front of you and kill you. Yep, we're good. That was it. We're done. And that's how you uh, revert the world back to normal from uh, being a bloody uh, iron wasteland. You just kill a big dick. It's the shopping mall just like before. That's all you do, you shoot it. You shoot it real good, just like Marcia just said. Don't worry, Heather, you're definitely just losing your mind. No point in checking all these shops, by the way. They're all locked. We're just getting out of here. That was the first area down, the shopping mall. Still not in his underwear. What just happened? You must be one of them. <laughs> You're a dick worm too, aren't you? And what do you mean by one of them? You're in on this with that Claudia, aren't you? Claudia? What about her? She asked me to find you, that's all. So you are one of them. Your house must be lousy with dick worms. Lousy, I say. I was just hired to find you. I'm not on anybody's side. I'm on money's side. Tell me about this. Why don't you start by telling me what happened here? Well, uh, someone didn't call the, the pest company. That? Dick Worm Pest Company. I don't know any more than you do. All I know is that things are getting really screwy around here, and and I have a gun. Bystander, but 
I can't feel sorry for you because you dragged me into this. You know, if you hadn't found me... What are you talking about? What's so special about you anyway? Well, she does have a gun. That, I wouldn't be so confused, would I? But I know there's something. Something I've been running from and forgot for a long time. Could this have to do with Silent Hill 1? Through the power of plot. Where are you going? I'm taking the subway home. So, uh, this entire next sequence. I do. How if I know? The subway sequence also, Heather is sassy as fuck, and I love her. So, this uh, sa subway sequence is entirely a big reference to Jacob's Ladder, which is a movie. Jacob's Ladder is a horror movie that had a huge influence on a bunch of Silent Hill games, and this subway sequence is a huge homage to it. If you like scary movies, I definitely um, I definitely recommend um, Jacob's Ladder. Uh, if you have Amazon Prime, you, you can actually wa watch it for free there on Amazon Prime Video. That's how Beth and I watched it. As usual, this place is completely deserted. And randomly locked up. Broken doors everywhere. What? What's... Do you guys see that, like, weird lighting? What is that? Look at that! Look at that, at the top of the screen! Did you see that? What was that? Oh, I don't like that. Let's get out of here. There's few things scarier in this game than, first of all, dick worms, and second of all, uh, bad emulation. What up? What up? Uh, no, no, okay. Yep, yeah, Bergen Street, whatever. Uh, realistically, we're just gonna trial and error until we find our way there. And there should be a map around here somewhere, even though she just said she didn't need a map. Oh, what's this? Fatal accident at Hazel Street. At about 11 p.m. on the 4th, a man waiting on the platform at the Hazel Street station fell onto the tracks and was decapitated by the arriving St. Renata Cal College bound train. The victim died instantly. While police have not yet determined whether the death was an accident or suicide, witnesses report that the victim did not look inebriated and seemed to jump off the platform deliberately. The victim's identity is still unknown. He was approximately 40 years old, 5 feet 10 inches tall, and was wearing a black jacket. Psst. Mmps, I say. Where is that map anyway? I forgot. This place is locked. Was it around here? I'd like to grab it if I could. Not that map. I mean, a map I can actually take with me. Maybe over here? Let's see. Could be that I just have to keep going a little bit. That's locked. And we tried these doors, didn't we? Okay, fine, fine, fine. We'll go the obvious place. Let's go. Oh, oh right, right, yeah. Okay, fine. Time to break the law. Didn't even pay for a ticket. Oh, there's the map. Excellent. Okay, subway. That's the next area. This place is relatively quick. If you don't get completely turned around, which people tend to get. Well, that's the sound that tells you that you're about to go to, um, the bad place. Bad, bad place. God, that's unnerving. I love this game. 
Alright, let's go. Ooh, that gives me the chills. Nowhere to go, but more down. And to a save point, of course. There we go. I remember being really annoyed at something and ending up back at that save point. Probably a train running me over. That's a thing. That goes just goes back to where we were before. Still haven't ended up more downwards. This way, maybe? Nope. Okay, well, this is where we need to end up once we find a thing. Okay. Further this way, then. I believe going upstairs there won't help us at all. Okay, this place is locked. Get down my map. But there's a passage right here. Down into the darkness. That's a good place to go in a Silent Hill game. Oh, fuck. Yep, this place is big and covered up in a grate. Other old transitions are just seamless in this game. It kind of just infects certain areas, but then completely disappears in others. It's kind of fascinating. Uh, is that a thing I want? It's not. No, 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 that's not a thing I want. Keep going down. Whoa, more messes. Does nobody clean up anything around here? Nutcracker. We're gonna crack some nuts. I mean, we already shot a dick worm. Any less would just be, would just be, you know, leaving things unfinished. Oh, no, 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 no. Do not, do not dog me. Please do not dog me. And down the other way. I believe there's some things here. Let's see. Here we go. I want this. Health drink, health drink. Come on, I see it. Thank you, handgun bullets. Come on, comment on it. Is someone sleeping here? All this red stuff around here is blood. This guy's not sleeping. What am I, why am I not the least bit surprised? I think that nightmare has numbed my senses a bit. Oh, Heather, you're so rational. I love you. Well, have a nice nap, dude. No, 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 no. And Beth is right. That nutcracker would have made more sense when there was a nut to crack. Like literally just a an actual nut. A walnut, one might say. All right, back here this way. Oh, that's an items. Nut crack. And now we can go here. Subway isn't that bad. And some actual guardrails. God damn. What a surprise. What could we have here? Shotgun shells. That's um some foreshadowing right there. Could it be that the shotgun is somewhere near? Like right in front of us? Thank you. I will take that. Okay, is there anything else in here? I don't even know. Well, there's this thing that just uh, decided to come take a nap. We're gonna walk around it. Rude. What's this over here? 
Lock broken. Then we go downwards. Never mind the rude people. <laughs> sir. Sir. Yeah, pretty much. Right, come on, camera. Camera. Give me a break here. More trash. Alright, let's see. Where's you now? There's some downward stairs. Lock broken. Might have to end up going down after all. Another way down. Okay. And door. Door? Door. Nope. No door. Okay. So, we have some more downwards ways to go. I think we're making g good progress here. I don't think I left anything behind. I mean, maybe some optional items, but... Oh, yes. Right. Is this the one with the whole light? Oh, yes, it is. Woohoo, boy. Okay. Please let me not fuck this up. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, 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 yep. Yep. Up. Let me up. Let me up, please. Please tell me I... Please. Please. Hello? Am I there? Oh, God. Thank... Thank fuck. Oh, I hate that part so much. No matter how many times I play this game, that always gets my adrenaline pumping. So you'd think that the subway doors uh, open and close by, right? Nope, they're literally on the other side of the world. Well, Marcia, you missed me almost getting run over. Oh, fuck. And you missed dogs! Nishia! Oh, can't go this way. No, no she out. Up, 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 up. Let me up, let me up. Okay, here we go. And we can just go back down this way. Nice and simple. This game makes me glad I don't have sexual trauma. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This game really does make you count your blessings, doesn't it? I'll drink. And open door. Really glad we found this train, huh, Heather? No, take the train. Take the train. It's okay. You wanted a train. Make up your mind, damn you. Nice loading screen, huh? So... This door back here, you can go out this door back here. It, you can literally fall off the end of the uh, edge of the train and die. I did that before, and ended, ended up back at that save point way back when. It was really frustrating. Also, save point. Really helpful of someone to just uh, draw these all over the place willy nilly, huh? All right, let's go. Because everyone knows that if you go up... If you keep moving up the train, then you get there faster. Die! Die! Melee combat! No, 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 give me a second here. Got him. I only got hit once. Okay, I'm getting the hang of this. Stop. Stop it. Get out of my way. Thank you. I'm coming for you. <laughs> Marcia, nice. Subway to the danger zone. I believe in one of these. Oh, yes. That's a, that's a big late. Uh, no, camera. Oh, 
health, 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 health. No, health, health, health is fine. Stop, don't dodge. That's illegal. Come on. Ow. Please. 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 Okay, there we go. How am I on? Yes. I told you they're dicks with legs. What did I tell you? Dicks, legs. Uh, what? Is there a thing? Yes. Thank you for looking at relevant things, Heather. You're wonderful. Best girl. Confirmed. Okay, I think in one of these places there's, um, bad news. Is this the place where there's bad news? Not yet. Okay, we're almost to the bad news place. There it is. Say hello to the bad news. Let me pass. Let me pass. Let me pass. Let me pass. I don't want to fight you. Yes! Okay. I think we are past the danger. Yep. That's the cutscene loading, uh, Fate the Black. I know it well. And this is how you safely arrive home. Clearly. We're fine. And it's true that it makes a lot more sense, Beth, if you've played one, why there's so much sexual imagery in this game. But, um, they explain it in this game too. So you... You mostly don't really need to have played the first game to understand what's going on in this game because they summarize it for you during the car ride. And I'll add my own little uh, tips and notes and input as I am wont to do. Heather sees men in underwear and floppy wieners everywhere. Yep, it's a condition. Oh boy, it's this part of the game. This is my least favorite part of the game. The sewer level. Let me out. I don't want to be in the sewer level. I don't like the sewer level. Nobody likes the sewer level. Find me one person that says that the sewer level in any game ever is their favorite part of the game. Find me that person so I can tell them off. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Gosh, things got real dangerous immediately. Oh, great. No, 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 no. Get me a map. I'm not making the same mistake again. I say again because I made this mistake last time I played this game. I did this entire area without a map. I was sad. These things really need to fuck off because they are screaming in my ears. Okay. That was at least the right place to go. Back to that door. No. No, 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 no. Enough. Do not take flight. That's forbidden. You are forbidden. None of you are free from sin. No. No. No, no. Ah, damn you. I'll kill you when I come back. Oh. No, 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 no. Okay, on guard, fuck boy. Where are you? Yeah. Yeah, eat it. Eat it. Deep throat. The pipe. We're good. Wait, was that a thing there? No? Okay, that was not a thing there. Here. God, more hallways. Just give me a map room. 
Not asking for much here. Oh, you. No! Don't step backwards like that. It makes things more difficult for me. It's devastating to my case. It, okay, you keep looking. Oh yeah, that's just because there's a door there. Okay, I get it now. I'm trying to keep a mental map in my head of this place. No, 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 no. Hallways are foreboding. Okay, I guess hallways aren't as foreboding as I thought. All right, get over here. Near. We're fine. Okay, at least these guys go down quickly. Oh, that's the sound of something that's not going to go down quickly. Ow, fuck. Damn it. Narrow hallway. Bad for melee. Uh, was there a thing there? Oh, Heather's tired. Oh dear, did I just go through here for nothing? Yes, I did go through here for nothing. Took damage for nothing? Ugh, damn it. Fine, homely where to go is this way. Let's go. Can I have a map yet, please? Really? Oh, no, that's a lot of boys. No, 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 no. Let's back up a bit. Stop making Chewbacca sounds at me. You don't deserve it. Please fall over. Okay. Enough. Thank you. Problem solved. Okay, what have we here? Uh, is this the map room? No, it's the fucking medieval mall room. Yeah, this is a thing we're not actually going to be using. This map, though, we're going to be using the hell out of. Thank you. Lord, I hate this place. Yep, underpass. Okay, so we have a medieval mall now. Uh, uh, uh. Let's check it out, why don't we? We're not breaking world records here. We're here to have fun. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Has some oomph to it, as Heather says. But it's slow as hell, and it'll get the shit beaten out of us. We're not gonna use it right now. Okay. Anything here? Nope. I guess I was thinking of a wrong barrel. I think that's it in this room, particularly. Okay, through here. Okay, so how's the map looking? So we came from up there. We have a door back there to check. Uh, we have a door back there to check. Okay, fine. We're going to check that door before we go this way, because this is probably the way forward. Oh, I feel... I feel... I feel disturbance in the pun force coming from Marcia's direction. Hi, Marcia. What is it? Okay, that was a waste of time. Let's go. You not using that weapon is... What is it, Marcia? Tell me what it is. Uh, a mauling? A, a, a mauling? Is that a word? A, a mauling? Do you mean appalling? Is that, a, is that a pun for appalling? I'm a little confused here. This is a good place to go. Uh, let's check out those other do doors before I go this way. Oh, okay. So it's a pun for appalling. Okay, I get it now. Um, thank you for your efforts, and thank you for for you. You've always been a friend of the stream, Marcia. That's all I have to say. Uh, let's see. I think we have a good thing here. We have good things here. Hell yeah. And a wine bottle. The premier uh, puzzle solving tool of our times. A wine bottle. Okay. 
Okay, where to? Uh, this way, I think? Correct way? Wrong way. Chewbacca noises. Enough. No, 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 no. Shotgun shells, yes, thank you. And a uh, real fake door. Okay, let's get out of here without uh, getting boxed in. Crap, I'm hitting the walls again. Okay. Looks like that one's running away. Can I sneak past now? Okay, here we go. We want to take the hallway to the right that has the big door. This one right here. Now we have everything we need. This place sure is a sausage fest. A walking sausage fest, no less. That makes it even worse. Ooh, hey, stop that. Oh, especially stop that. Uh, okay, let's see if there's anything at the end of the hallway. Oh, there's one of these fuckers. Okay, okay. Big mistake. We're out of here. I've learned the error of my ways. Okay. Well, this place is at least going a lot better than it did last time. Due to actually having a goddamn map. So far, we're at least ensuring that we don't have to backtrack. Because I have all the things. All right. What have we here? Left, right, straight. Okay, let's see what's to the left. To the left. You know I just make puns for the content, right? I'm not trying to aggravate you. No, 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 no. It's okay. I love your puns, honestly. It's just that me being, uh, me groaning in pain at your puns is also part of the equation. Really, you're a very smart girl, Marcia. I appreciate your puns. They're clever. You're clever. Lock's broken. Understandable. Have a nice day. Um, okay. So just one way to go, I think. Let's see if I get proven wrong. I got proven wrong. No, 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 no. No. The dream. Oh, the, yes, the dream. What have we here? Okay, two rooms. Good to know. Machine control room. I think we can't do anything here yet. Yep, we can't do anything here yet. We need gasoline before we can come here. Back out we go. Is this the right room? Yes, it is the right room. Hello. Kerosene. Give me the kerosene. Ah, yes. Kerosene wine, my favorite. Let's save. Yeah, don't worry, Marcia. I actually r really like that you make puns and stuff. It keeps the conversation going, honestly. It gives me things to talk about. Otherwise, I'm just talking to myself. I mean, I usually do that, but, you know. Okay, health drinks. I don't know if there's anything else in here. Nothing to read, at least. Ooh, hello. Hello, gun food. May I have some of this, please? Thank you. Okay, out of here, I want to check to the right. There's probably not going to be anything, but maybe a few supplies will be at the end there. No, 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 no. This place is rife with dick worms. Lousy with dick worms. Oh, wait, is this place unlocked? Oh, shit. Uh... No, 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 no. Sh sh show me what we got going on here. I know I. Oh, Jesus. 
No! Ow! Ah! It was a trap. This whole place is a trap. Ugh, I, re I regret life. If bullets are gun food, what is it called when you shoot the gun? Um. Uh. And. Eh, and. Eh, and eh, eh, eating disorder? Uh. That was probably really bad, wasn't it? <laughs> um, um, moving along. Now we get to... Well, first of all, let me show you why we want to turn this, uh, this machine on. Because there's shit down there. You can't go into the shithole. Even though this entire game kind of takes place in a shithole, really. No. This won't do. We need machinery. Okay, can I can I turn you on now? All right, I turn you on over here. Um, can, can I? There we go. Thank you. Ah ha ha ha. We're fine, we're fine. Let me check on something real quick. Hmm, okay. Oh, cursor, oh wait. All right, now we can go down here. Cause this place literally isn't just trash anymore. We're getting somewhere. This next this next part is even worse though. Take my word for that. I mean, I'll show you that it's even worse. But yes, it's even worse. No place, no wonder this place is all rusted. It was like submerged in water. <laughs> yes, Marcia, we are getting somewhere. I promise, I'm not, I, I'm not, I do not lie. I don't lie to my beloved audience. All right, as soon as we're through here, we're checking the goddamn map. Okay. To the right. To, 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 to the right. Yeah, relatable. Oh, bye. Smell you later, jerk. Uh, where is that door? Okay, we're coming up on it. So let's just climb up now. Here we go. I think there's an item at the end of this hallway that we need. If I remember correctly. Could this be the hairdryer? I don't really think a hairdryer is going to fix our hair after all this bullshit. Oh, hello down there. Hey, buddy. How you doing? T t taking a nap down there? That's fine. That's cool. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, here we are. It was the hairdryer. Told you. Grabbing this thing keeps us from being insta-killed later. Also ampoule, because drugs. Is there another thing here? I could have sworn I saw her looking. Nope, I think that's it for this place. Alright, that was the hair dryer room. Now we can continue. Also, thing's gone. <laughs> Beth, why does that amuse you so much? <laughs> Cool, 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 cool. <laughs> uh, okay, here we go. Where are we going now? I believe... Okay, we're going to the correct place. As totally intent... All oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I was gonna say all according to Keikaku, but uh, dick worms are never part of the Keikaku. Yeah! 
juked. Good evening, Smash, though. I hope you're having a lovely Friday. I'm having a lovely Friday. Any Friday where I get to dodge dick worms is a good Friday. Uh, throw another save. Oh, right, yes. I thought it made a sound when it saves, but it does not. Okay, so... Danger keep out. I don't think I will. I've kind of been in danger this entire goddamn time. Let's see. There is a relevant diary here. There's a monster in the water. The bastards killed two of my buddies. I should never have doubted that old urban legend about alligators in the sewers. That was no myth. But no one believes me. They were drunk and slipped? We're not that damn stupid. Even calling it a monster isn't quite right. This is something else. All I know is something's in there. I'm going now to beat that thing's head in. If you find this note, consider it my will. Revenge is futile, or so you may think, reading this. But Jose and Jaime were my best buddies. Wish I knew how to do the deed. Guns won't work underwater. Even my famous knife work won't do much. If only I had a hand grenade. You've got the next best thing, a blow dryer. And yes, danger, keep out. All right, check it out. There's an outlet here. Clearly outlets are for blow dryers. Get dried. Ha. Think I was going to go like, yeah, uh I've seen enough anime to see the, to know where this is going. Well, nope. We don't know where this is going because it's dead. We killed the anime. I think that's the end of the underpass. That that little section there. Let's check the map. Um. Well, we're not getting in there. No. Back up slowly. Okay. Of course I'm kidding. You can never kill anime. Oh, God. You can't kill things screaming at you from across the world either. Oh, God. Ew. I need to get new boots after this. Hey, let me up. Thank you. Um. All right. Where's a good path here? I like that door over there. Arcia, Heather is a witch girl, and I'll tell you why as soon as these things stop screaming at us. It's still screaming. Come on, quiet down. I need to talk. And I'll tell you why. Because uh, when you start the game in New Game Plus, she gets a thing called um, a Heather Beam. Where she can shoot a laser from her eyes. And if you uh, unlock a magical girl cons a costume and equip it, then the Heather Beam is upgraded to the Sexy Beam. And in like some like really broken Japanese, she says something like Sexy Beam. It's it's interesting to say the least. And that's it. That's the underpass. No, let me back in. No, just kidding. Fuck the underpass. I hate this place. And out we go. What a thrill, etc., 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 etc. Yep, out of here. Heather does not have time for this nonsense. No, I'm not BSing right now, by the way, Beth. The Heather Beam is a real thing. It's a New Game Plus thing. For some reason, Silent Hill games really love getting silly with the game in New Game Plus. Because once you've actually been done being scared by it, you get things like the sexy beam. <laughs> the, the sexy beam is a real thing. The sexy beam is canon. In we go. Let me just adjust myself. Ow. My butt hurts. Okay. Fuck going home though. We have some creepy apartments to explore. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> this place is uh, creepy from the word go. Just listen to those sounds. God damn. Get up there. Yay! Those are good sounds. Locked. Locked. The third level ceiling has crumbled. For safety's sake, entry is forbidden. For a second there, that looked like three Ds. I've had enough Ds for one night. No more Ds, especially the walking ones. The walking D. I'm sorry, that was horrible. I apologize. Go. There's not a lot of dickworms here. Uh, we won't be seeing dickworms for... Uh, actually, I can't remember. Are there dickworms in here? For some reason, I, for, for a moment there, I thought someone was knocking at our door, but that's actually just the game. I can tell that's the game because uh, the green bars are going up on my headphones instead of my microphone on my sound mixer. Okay. So, I guess a hobo left some gun food here from us for us. Good hobo. So there's a secret here. There's a secret here. It's so easy to miss this thing. Hey, buddy. You got a silencer. Yeah, that guy's stuck in there. And we got a silencer. Makes your gun quieter, but less powerful. I'm not going to use it. That's just a neat little secret. Um, I think that's it for this place. Okay, it is. So, time to jump down a hole. Because this is Silent Hill. You jump down holes. But see, Heather is smarter than James. She practices safety. She throws the mattress down there so that's safe. Whoop. I mean, that mattress looks like it's two inches thick, but, you know, better than just, like, diving in face first like James does for, like, two miles. Okay. So, a park apartment complex. Let's start finding our way around. This is our next area after the underpass. Well, not quite this. We're actually going to be entering the apartment complex next door. Oh, no. This isn't dangerous at all. And in through the window. Heather likes windows more than doors. I actually don't know what those spinny things are. I don't know what they're supposed to represent. I don't know what they're called. I just hate them. Is there anything in here? Nothing? Nope, just therapy. Okay, out of here. <sighs> so, this is the apartment complex. Pretty sure you get a map to it very early on, if I remember correctly. You don't want to miss it. Nope. Back in we go. I'm not ready yet. My heart's not ready. Uh, is the map in here? Oh, hey, it's this place. This is a nice place, isn't it? This is a real nice place. Cl pay close attention, okay? I hope you're watching. Oh. 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 Hey, are you okay over here? Aw, the mannequin has blood. <laughs> this? This is blood. <laughs> Heather has no more comment. Yep. God, I love this game. Freaky as hell. Okay, now we can go out. Now my heart is ready. Nope. 
No, God, stop it. Enough. We're gonna go dancing instead. Oh, yeah, great. Dancing studio. Is there actually anything in here? I can't remember. No, this place is just fuckery central. Nope. Oh, glad we're never going in there ever again. Okay, what have we in here? Map. There we go. Told you we got it early. We get a save point early, too. Really interesting painting to uh, hang up in an art suit uh, in a dancing studio, but you know, I won't judge. Also, according to that uh, complete uh, save file um, time I have there, we're like a quarter through the game. Okay, so that's something we have to come back to. That drawer is stuck. We need something to yank it open with. Okay, I believe we're done with this place. Till we get the thing to, um, you know, yank it open. Let's check out the rest of these doors here. Hey there. Lockers. Don't mind if I help myself. Um, don't, don't mind if I, uh, fix, fix the camera angle a little bit? Yes? No? It's an interesting picture there. Kind of looks a little creepy. Can't really get a good look at it, though. Oh, bullets. Bullets are good. Okay. We are good to go back down there and take an immediate left. Uh, the dog left. No. No, no, no. Enough. Literally fuck off. Okay, where are we going here? Okay, we have bathroom there and then a door up to the right. Okay, nothing here. No! 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 Here. Okay, we're good. We're gonna have to go back there for the drawer. Then after that, nothing else. Okay, let's start by going downstairs. Down's a good policy. And also, every broken door in the stairwell means another floor that we don't need to, um, search. The more you know... Nothing. Okay. So we're just going up from here. Third floor is the lowest floor we have to worry about. I believe there's a fourth and a fifth floor, if I remember correctly. Also, good evening to everyone that's new to the stream. My name's Lyra. I like, um, anime girls and, um, scary things. And sometimes scary things with anime, anime girls. Oh, there's a lot more floors than I thought. Okay, no dogs on this floor, at least. No elevator, either. I like to um, examine doors even if I know that they're, um, the locks are broken, just so that it shows up on the map. Okay, locked. That's somewhere that we need to come back to. Here we go. Now we just get to relax and examine art for the rest of the game. What have we here? Flame purifies all. Oh, wait, what? Okay, she said something interesting there. She said, I'm not, I'm not fond of fire. It's scary somehow. We will uh, learn what she means by that soon enough. <laughs> wait, that door there. Do we have anything of interest in here? We do not. Okay, back in. I believe the best weapon in the game is lurking somewhere around here. It's not the screwdriver, but close. This, okay, over here. 
step into my... Yes? Yes! Katana! Hey there! Oh, I have been waiting for you. My one true love, the katana. Oh my god, it's so good. It slices things up so good. There's, of course, another one here. But she doesn't need another one of those. Because, you know, dual wielding isn't the coolest thing in the world. Tisk tisk, poor taste. Okay. What's the situation here? We have a screwdriver, so we can go back downstairs. I want to check that. Okay. So right to the left of out of here, there's a door that I want to hit up. Let's check it out. Nothing. Okay. Back to the stairwell. Um, which was where again? Uh, what does this stairwell look like? Okay. That's probably that one to the right. Okay. Here we go. Yep. Sorry. Um, I lapsed into stupidity, stupidity there for a second, uh, more than usual. All right, down to the fourth floor. And of course, oh no, third floor, sorry. Of course, we're going to be uh, greeted by copious amounts of dogs. You know, when I say it that way, it sounds like a good thing, but it's not a good thing. Okay. To the left. To the left. I'm in straight ahead. No. No, I'm bad. I'm terrible. Katana! Just swing it, swing it wildly. <laughs> I'm so good at this game. I'm so good at this game. And I'm dying in this game. Ugh, you piece of fuck. Get over here. Run into my kit. Yeah! No, you can't get back up. You're not allowed. You, you got any more of them dogs? Where are you? Are you nearby? Okay, fuck it. Fuck it. Just fuck it. In. Okay, we're good. Now, drawer is just right here. And what is it that we get from here? Why, it's no other than... Than being positioned poorly. Damn it. Now we can. Y'all need some oil. Also rope. But we can't quite do anything with that yet. We can go- we have to go up a floor before we can do anything. Oh, no, 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 no. One dog death was enough for me on this floor. Up we go. So, we're on the third floor. I believe we're done with the fifth floor for now. Let's try the sixth floor then. Going up, please. I need a crank. Oh, I guess we didn't properly explore the fifth floor then. Whoops. Let's take another look then. What have we here? Oh, there's a door there. Nope. Sense of direction, please. Is it down this way? It is down this way, to the right. Okay, here we go. Oh, great. Love that sound. Could that be that long-awaited familiar sound that we haven't heard since the mystical time of like 10 minutes ago? Yep, it's dickworm, dickworm time. But not quite yet. 
Hey, 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 hey. That was just a prank, bro. No. Eat katana. God, that's so good. I love the katana. No. Bat. Yeah, it does splash damage. Didn't stand a chance. Okay, can I... Can I, like, walk... Thank you. And now we're here. Hello. Uh, health drink, thank you. There is an item that I need in here. Where is it? There you are, Jack. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more. Oh, I'm tired. Um, I think we got everything that we needed out of this room. Okay, we're good. Let's just, uh, check those last two doors. In which direction? In this direction. And then we can unlock that door from the other side. Okay. So at some point we needed to check an elevator door that we didn't. Where are the elevators at? So it wasn't the elevators on this floor then. So I missed an elevator on the third floor. Okay, I can deal with that. Time we go. I think we killed the dogs here, huh? Yep, there it is. No need to check the map, it's right there. Okay, so. Jack the force is open and a rope to climb down. Heather is way too brave for her own good. Okay. And rope. And now we are getting somewhere. To non-dog non -dog pastures, I hope. Well, to a save point, first of all. This place is saving save point and uh, selling save points. For free, of course. We're not Resident Evil here. No, this is a superior series, and you can fight me on that. Okay, where to now? Bathroom? Nope. Bathroom? Nope. I believe we're close to that part of the apartments. Here we go. What have we here? Is this a thing to read? Can I read you? You're looking at something. Come on. What am I not seeing here? Heather, what are you looking at? Oh, beef jerky. Of course you were looking at beef jerky. Next to dogs, Sue. Who would have thought? Oh boy, buckle up, kids. Dark red stain, huh? Well, I guess this is Silent Hill. Doesn't really mean anything. Doesn't mean anything at all. Hey, now's a good time for a bath. No one's gonna walk in on us, right? Gotta get some fan service in the game, right? Oh, I knew it. I mean, what did you what did you think would happen, Heather? Honestly, that's more plausible than water coming out of it. Whoops. You expected too much and now the other world is pissed.
good going on making the world go to shit. Now we have to fix this. It's being invaded by the other world. By a world of someone's nightmarish delusions come to life. Hello, uh... Uh, HD version of Harry Mason talking in Silent Hill 1. <laughs> this game continues to make no sense. It is Silent Hill. Did she do this too? Fucking tub. Yep, now everything's completely fucked. Welcome back to the other world. Welcome back to the other world. Welcome back indeed. Hey there, buddy. Whatever the hell you are. Okay, let's see. And gun bullets. Hey, hey there, buddy. Hey, uh, just hanging out, huh? Nice uh, doll you got there. Yep. This place isn't creepy at all. Oh shit. No, enough of this. We're going to therapy. What's this? Find the holy one. Kill her. That's an interesting to-do list. Oh, is that is that us? That's us. That's Heather. Is Heather the holy one? I mean, Heather is uh, bound to poke holes in people, if that's what you mean. Mental clinic. That seems like a good place to be right now. Oh, and it's this jerk face. He's one of those guys that you love to hate. Hi. Heather. That's what you're called now, isn't it? And who are you? This guy's not being coy at all. Don't forget it, okay? I turn up the sound a bit. I'm on your side. So you say. But how do I know you're not with her? her? Good instincts. You mean Claudia? Please don't lump me together with her. She was totally brainwashed by that crazy old hag. Dude, you are sus as fuck. I guess crazy old hag is a bit harsh. She is your mother, after all. My mother? You can't just drop bombs like that out of nowhere. It's illegal. Don't remember? Uh, so Harry didn't tell you anything. And now he's name dropping the protagonist of the first game. Yes, he hit the truth to keep you on his side. Eh? That figures. He's a pretty sneaky guy. Don't talk about my dad like that. Sorry. I apologize. Please. Bad mouthing oh, Heather's God. daddy is a good way to activate her Heather rage. I know everything. I know about your past, too. Then tell me what's going on. You don't know even that? That's why I'm asking. Shit's fucked, yo. If you know everything, then tell me how I can put an end to this. Not yet. Why not enjoy yourself a bit longer? Enjoy? I feel like I'm going crazy. Well, I mean, the game's only been going for like two hours. Does this place get to you at all? Oh, it gets to me all right. I find it most fascinating. Gets to him? More like it gets him off. Wait! I'm not finished talking. I'm finished listening. I knew you were on her side. How do you figure? Something wrong with you too. 
Silent Hill in a nutshell. All right, what do we got here? Oxidol. That's uh, something we need. Wait, was that another health, health drink I picked up? Here. When you pour diluted hydrogen, uh, okay. When you pour diluted hydrogen peroxide onto manganese dioxide, oxygen is produced. Although oxygen will not burn on its own, it will help other things to burn. Yes, that is a puzzle. I mean, less of a puzzle and more just combine items to achieve results. Yes, manganese dioxide. A staple of the American household. Let's keep going. I think uh, we'll finish the other world apartments and call it a night. Yo, oh boy. Okay, talking to crazy people is all it takes to make all of the assholes come out. Okay, we missed a door that back there. No, lock broken. Yay! Back up. No, stop crawling on me. That's weird. I do not want to fight you. These guys are pains in the ass. Door. Door. Ow. This sucks. Stop crawling on me. Door. Thank God I have that Kevlar on. Okay. Uh. No. No. Do not want. Let me up. Let me up. Functioning elevator. A rare find in Silent Hill. Oh, God. I don't think I ever have to come back to that floor. Thank fuck for that. First floor. We'll start from the bottom and work our ways up. What have we here? Oh, right. It's this thing. Hey, buddy. Yeah, he's just there. Just blocking the way. Being a jerk. Basically, the way to get out of here is to kill that thing. Keep that in mind. Oh, hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Can we, like, ignore you? That'd be nice. Pork liver. Those are some rations in case we get hungry. Okay, I'm gonna grab that and go. Grab that and go. Go, 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 go. This is the go part of grabbing that. Okay, we're out. Okay. That siren sound is so creepy. Locked. All right, back to the elevator. How's our health doing? Uh, that could bear a health drink. There we go. We have enough of them after all. Okay, first floor down. Needed that pork liver. Don't ask why. Time for the second floor. Oh, Jesus. Wait, did I just come back to the back? Oh, I just came back to the bad floor. Okay. Time. Oh, wait. I missed the door here. Is this the door I missed? It is the door I missed. Let's check it out. Okay. Now I can come back here and let it rest well on my conscience. Ugh. It's not resting well on my conscience how that guy's crawling all over me. Ugh. Gross. Okay. Now the second floor will never be visited ever again. Third floor. Third floor? Nope. Fourth floor. I 
And what have we here? Knock, knock, enter, and... Yeah, okay. All right. Got anything else to say? No? That's all you had, huh? Okay, I get it. Also, uh, there's some legs here. Don't worry about it. Locked. And... Locked. Yep. I had a feeling that this was that floor. Okay. Fourth floor is just locked doors. Now we hit up the fifth floor. Eventually, we're going to end up on a floor where we can do things. No monsters, at least. But I can hear from here. Gives us a little bit of a break. Lock broken. Lock broken. So it's just going to be this door, huh? I'm fine with that. Oh, Jesus. The sounds these things make. Bleh. No, 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 no. You crawl all over someone else today. No. Oh, hello. That's a reference to session, session nine. There you go. Beth, you recognize that. Me safe. Okay, so far so good. We're making some good progress because. Oh, wait, no, we're missing the matches. Never mind. Yep, flame purifies all. By these remains, may a person find the road to paradise. Okay, so we almost have the things we need for that. We just need a match. Okay, where to now? I just need to test out this one. No, nothing. Okay. Back out we go. Back, back, back. And now we plot out the rest of our routes. Okay, we're just going to run to the end of the hallway. Shit, 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 shit. No! Stop it! No! Enough! Okay, here we go. Ha! You're stuck! You suck! Oh, I guess I'm stuck too, huh? Okay, whatever. One more door over here. Here we go. Okay, hey there. Speaking of things I need. Oh, come on, walk correctly, Heather. No more cigarettes for me, I quit for good. Which is interesting considering she's uh, 17, I believe. Really interesting comment. Someone to have quit for good at 17. Heather's had an interesting life. Okay, we're running all the way back. Shit. Get, let me up, let me up, let me up. Here we go. Now we can do the thing with the art. Right there. Flame purifies all, it says. So uh, let's do a little purification, shall we? Okay. One, two, three. We are playing a video game. How about I don't? Uh, sometimes you just gotta don't. 
That's just a fact of life. Heather does a lot of science in this game. Fuck your puzzles and such. We just, we, we science. We perform chemical reactions to save the day here. Anywhere there's a door up here. So of course we're going to crawl into it. Hey, that's a, uh, that's a real nice, ni nice pictures you got there. Really good artwork. That's the private collection. Blah. What's this? The priestess accepted the king's request and went to the village gates. But when she saw the monster, she tried to convince it with words instead of killing it. Shut up, you. I'm going to eat you. Uh, I'm going to eat you up. The monster didn't listen to a word the priestess said. But she kept trying to convince the monster to give up. It's wrong to eat people, you know. The monster grew very, very angry at this and attacked her, killing her with a single mighty blow. I probably missed the beginning somewhere. Whatever, it doesn't matter. The ending is the only part that actually matters. New, no. new. No. Let me out, let me out, let me out. This is not a drill. Oh, unlocked, hello. That doesn't help me here though. Come on, we're getting out of here. I don't like the crawly place. God, I hate those monsters. They're really hard to kill, too. Oh, boy. It's this place. Brace yourselves, kids. Fucking brace. Yep. I knew you were there. Stop vibrating. Hey. What even are you? You're wearing like a horse mask. You cargo pants? Uh, I'll use handgun bullets to get handgun bullets, I guess. It was a net gain of seven. Oh, wait, no. We want supplies. There we go. First aid kit is good, though. We want to stock up on those. Talk about a monster under the bed. Um, straightforward. Here we go. Even more of those fuckers in here. Or maybe just on the other side. It's unlocked. Right, yeah, we just went out over to the other side. I don't need to go there, though. No, stop! Heather, keep a firmer stance. Please. Okay, here we go. Yes, money. And now with this money, what can we do? Thus one's life turns to riches. What was a bag of silver coins is now the number in a book. Yet fate hath no price. Ha, ah, but do people know this? Uh, I, I just know that I'm going to get myself a drink. A drink from the other world. Food from here is good, right? This isn't just going to be a can of blood. Of course it's not going to be a can of blood. It's going to be a can of key. This is Silent Hill. Of course it's going to be that. Life insurance. Here, let's see if we can examine it. There's a tag on the key that says Elberton Life Insurance. Excellent. 
I don't know where that is. All right, let's check for locked doors. Okay, life insurance, life insurance. It's not up there. Elberton life insurance. Oh, yeah, there it is, Elberton life insurance. Okay, we want to head to the first floor. So through the unlock, nope. Nope, first we want to get crawled on, as is tradition. Jerks. All right, now we can take the elevator to the first floor. Okay. I believe we're almost done here. First floor. Thankfully, I'm pretty sure we don't have any monsters hanging around here. Other than that big scary hallway one. Let's take another look at him. Spooky. Alright, locked door was right here. Let's go get some life insurance. Just in case we fucking die here. Alright, not this way, other way. Alright, there's gonna be some crawly boys around here, aren't there? Crawly boys! Cr cr crawly? Loud crawly boys! Oh, aim! Oh, okay, they're busy eating and being loud as hell. Jesus Christ. Also, wow, someone had a really bad time in this room. Hey there. Story time again? The king and his people shed tears at the death of the kind priestess. God took pity upon them, and granting their wishes, healed the priestess. The priestess opened her eyes just as she had done every morning of her life. She went once more to the monster's lair. Fool, you wish to die again? No, this time it's your turn. The priestess had come to defeat the monster once and for all. As the priestess was very, very kind, she felt sad about this task, but it had to be done. Swords and spears won't work. Arrows and bullets will just bounce off. You can't kill me, the monster laughed. But the priestess used neither sword nor spear. She chanted but a single spell. Tu fui, ego eris. Do you know what happened then? The monster let out a huge cry and then died and vanished. Thus the villagers were able to use their gates once more. Everyone lavished their gratitude upon the priestess, and they all lived happily ever after. Ego Fooey. Weird writing. <gasps> what was that? It's like you don't even know Latin. Come on, Heather. And that was the sound of that monster having a bad time, theoretically. Also, the monsters out here are gone too. Saying that killed everything in this um in this apartment complex. Makes you wonder uh why that spell was effective when Heather chanted it, huh? Really makes you wonder. Oh, hello. Oh, it's the first part. Wait, no, 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 no. We don't need to read the whole thing. We don't need to read the whole thing. Okay. Basically, there's there's an asshole over there, and you want to kill him. That's it. That's the story. And we're back in normal place again. Normal place that has a giant canvas blocking off roads, apparently. Is that just like a thing that happens? Because I've never seen it in real life. Maybe, wait, maybe I've just never been to Portland. I mean, not maybe. That's definitely. Things are weird in Portland. Don't go to Portland. Also, there's like literally no one out there. 
It's empty. Really quiet. Oh, wrong side of the street. Back we go. It's no Silent Hill, but I'll take it. The only reason we're kind of running so slow right now is because we have the bulletproof vest on right now, but I mean... It's only a little bit of a change, to be honest. Not worth taking it off. <sighs> oh yes, what Beth said. That's what those words mean. As you are, I was. As I am, so you shall also be. Basically, that's just her saying, uh, I was like really dead, but now I'm not dead anymore, but now you're going to be dead. So basically, that was just the Latin version of I am rubber, you are glue. Whatever you'd say bounces off of me and sticks to you. That's what she just said. Save point. That is an interesting assessment, Zach. You're paying attention. This is good. Okay, this is the way. You can tell because of the camera angle. Oh. Dad, I'm home. Listen, something really crazy is going on. I think we should... Dad? Dad? Uh, oh. <gasps> Daddy's <gasps> fucked. It was old age. Yep, this is Heather Mason. I mean, this is Harry Mason. No. He was the protagonist of the first game. No. And now Harry is fucking dead. No, no chance you're gonna, like, call the cops or anything, right? Kind of heart wrenching. <laughs> and now, what did I tell you about that Heather Rage? Here we go. We picked up that shotgun for a reason. He Maybe ate my ice cream. Our dream would have come true. And then he took you away from us. I'll get you for this. Yeah, you told her. There is a hey, Lone Bub. I hope you're having a good Friday. Your heart with hate. You're just in time for a boss fight. See, I told you we got the shotgun for a reason. She points the gun, but then she doesn't... She, she, she doesn't... She had ample amounts of time to pull, pull the trigger. Ugh, fight a pointless boss fight, I guess. If you insist... All 
right. This guy's the missionary. This guy's an asshole. We're equipping the shotgun. Okay. So if you shoot him from the front, he blocks your... Ow. Uh, well, first of all, he does that. He, he shanks you. Yeah, if you um, attack him from the front, then he blocks your bullets. Even though you're, like, shooting him with literally a shotgun slug, he can block... Oh, hey. Come on, Leatherface. Get up. No, 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 no. Oh, I missed. There we go. So far, so good. We're doing good here. Hey. Where is he? Uh, reload from the menu because that is much faster. Keep running. <laughs> Camera, please. Kick him. Kick him while he's down. Get him. In the ass. No. Wait, was that the... Yes, it was. Hello. Just give me some time to chug. And we can continue our duel. Oh, crap. Oh, fuck. Just run around like an idiot, why don't you? It'll only prolong the inevitable. Fuck. I need to get my timing down. Eh, shit. This guy's running, a, pulling a running attack on me like it's Smash. Okay, we got him. Taking out fools without a word. That is the Heather way. That is the Mason way. Killing monsters is the family business. Then don't say anything. I'm fine, so just get out of here and leave me alone already. Calm down. I just Yeah, I mean entering her house was kind of a little much, buddy. By the way, the voice acting for Heather is amazing. Make you feel better? I will. Also, this guy is just like some random guy they pulled off of out of Brooklyn, I guess. Also, he says that, but he 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 didn't get out. Is he okay like this? He's dead like this. What else can I do? There's no one here to give him a decent burial. There's just no one here. <sighs> I'm sorry, Dad. What do you do now? Rip Harry Mason. I'm going to Silent Hill. It was truly the best of us. What's in Silent Hill? The rest of the game. I don't know. Do you think it's safe? Of course it isn't. I don't know what kind of hell is waiting for me there, but I. It's like no he didn't choice. read the manual. Come on, man. I don't care about God or paradise. If that's what she believes, then fine. But she won't get away with what she did. When I find her, I'll kill her myself. You had an ample chance to do that earlier, Heather. I mean, I get it was kind of an emotional moment, but you literally had the gun pointed at her. Maybe not, but that's what I'm going to do. How did you get there? None of your business. Cutscene. I'll give you a ride. I don't need your help. Yeah, but it's too far to walk. Besides, I'm partly responsible for this. 
Well, at least this guy isn't a total idiot. I'll bring the car around back. Come by and we'll finish saying goodbye. You know, you might die too. Only if we get the bad ending. Fine. Nobody's gonna cry over my grave. <sighs> Real tragic characters in this game. Hey, man. I'll find that woman and make her pay. I promise I will. I wonder if my dad would be mad at me for thinking that way. Ugh. <sighs> uh. Dirty bathroom, just like every other place in Silent Hill. Okay, I want to head to Heather's room. Here we go. That was a stun gun and some stun gun batteries. That's useful in some minute situations, but it's better to pick it up than to not pick it up. Hey, come on. Hey, 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 come on. Dad, why did you have to die? Oh, wait. Crap, I missed it. She said, you once told me you were the strongest man in the world. Liar. Oh, God, poor girl. Also, knowing that this is Harry Mason, you'd think that he'd keep, like, a stock of uh, health drinks in the kitchen, but that is not the case. We're out of here. Just a corpse and some sad memories here now. Nothing left for us. Okay. So... This upcoming cutscene is extremely important if you haven't played Silent Hill 1. This will explain everything to you. So pay close attention to this upcoming cutscene, the one after this one. Also pay close attention to it because the song that plays during it is gorgeous. Vincent. Vincent? He's a friend of yours, right? Well, I'm not sure. He said when we get to Silent Hill, We'll end the stream right after this cutscene, don't worry. He gave me this map. What do you want to do? We can't trust him, but we've got no other choice. Here, take this too. What's this? Your father was holding it. It's a plot summary. All right, here we go. This cutscene, extremely important. Explain Silent Hill 1. The song that plays during this cutscene is called Letter from the Lost Days. What's the deal with Silent Hill anyway? It used to be a nice, quiet little town. But now... Now pachinko machines. You've been there? Damn you, Konami. Once. On a missing persons case. Silent Hill 2 reference incoming. Never did find him. But I'll tell you, that's one screwed up town. It's implied that he went to find I'm James. You hear a lot of nasty rumors. I was born and raised there. <sighs> Sorry. Your hometown's a shithole, kid. No offense taken. There it is. Anyway, I thought you grew up in Portland. Wrong. Feeling sick? I'm gonna turn the sound up a little bit. Maybe your car sick. No. I'm just trying to remember. 
my childhood. Something terrible happened in Silent Hill 17 years ago. A woman named Dahlia. She tried to summon the ancient god of the town. That's Alessa's mother. She offered up her very own daughter. It's crazy. Maybe so, but it worked. The girl gave birth to a god. Because Alessa's a witch. You see, that girl had special powers. Powers? Her classmates called her a witch. She could make things happen with her mind. She could kill people just by wishing for it. She's kind of OP. In the end, that god was killed by a single person. My father, Harry Mason. Also OP. I guess it wasn't much of a god if it could be killed by a human being. Sorry, I'm just adjusting my chair. But I think Claudia's trying to do the same thing again. And I've been chosen as the sacrifice. You've got some kind of power in you too? After the god was killed, the girl reappeared. Because the good ending is the canon ending in she Silent Hill 1. A baby in her arms. Before she died, she gave the baby to my father. his very own daughter even though he didn't know who or what I was a delinquent apparently it was so sudden I never had a chance to tell you, to tell you how happy you made me. I hope you were paying attention. That was a lot of lore. And a really pretty song. I'm gonna head for that Leonard guy's house. You check out the hospital. Got the map, right? Yeah. You gonna be okay alone? I'm not a child, you know. Better alone. Are you sure Did you see how Maria was? Right. I am afraid. I'm fifty something years old. I've never seen nothing like this. I still feel like I'm dreaming. <laughs> More like a nightmare. A nightmare, I'd say. Uh I I forgot yeah. she said that there. <laughs> Back here when you finish looking around the hospital. Okay? Roger. All right. That's going to be next time. Next time we're going to go explore the hospital. Going to get out of this uh, gross ho uh, hotel room. Just throw down a save now real quick right here okay everyone 
we're calling it for tonight. Uh, thank you so much for um, watching tonight. I really love this game, and I'm really happy I could share it with all of you. Uh, don't forget to follow if you haven't already. Um, and I will stream again this weekend, uh, one of these nights. I don't know which one. Uh, check my Twitter, check my Discord, all that. Make sure to follow those. Those are in my channel description. And other than that, see you guys then. Good night, everyone. Thank you again for watching. Bye-bye.